Good evening. I'm Christina Gasford. As you saw, Darren is on assignment at the fair. And I'm Kat Villianzoni. The man who eluded police on a bike and a boat this week is still on the run. But, but Eric Edson has been caught dozens of times over the years with at least 44 felony convictions on his record. Channel 3's Cam Smith is digging into Edson's criminal past. 52-year-old Eric Edson is currently wanted by Burlington police on charges of impeding and assaulting two police officers, as well as theft and damage to a sailboat he allegedly stole to get away from police on Wednesday. This is a person who's lived in Burlington for a very long time, has a, a long history of, of engagement with law enforcement even in Burlington. Where is he now? We don't know. Channel 3 News has chronicled Edson's criminal activity through the years as far back as 1987. Edson talked to our Brian Joyce while in prison in 1998 about a stint he had served in a Virginia prison. I think the corrections made a good decision when they said, uh, we're going to send some people to a real prison because we don't have it bad in Vermont corrections. Sounds like you're saying you think the Vermont prison system ought to be tougher than it is. Yeah, that's it. Because I probably wouldn't be in jail right now if I would have got a, a little taste of how prison really can be. In. Less than a year later, Edson was arrested again after a car chase with police from Winooski to Waterbury. By 2008, when Edson was 37 years old, he had already served 20 years in prison. That same year, he was in the news again, the target of a manhunt after suspected home invasions and burglaries in the Champlain Islands. Edson was sentenced in that case in 2010. Our cameras were in the courtroom when Edson pleaded to the court for another chance, claiming then he was ready to stay crime-free. Edson told Judge Joseph he's a good person who often lost his battle with drugs and alcohol. Well, Your Honor, I just want to um, apologize to the people that I've trespassed in this. Judge Ben Joseph ultimately sentenced Edson to serve 10 to 12 years in prison for his involvement in the home break-in. He was charged as a habitual offender. Nothing's going to change this man. This is what he is. Now, Edson's behavior has not changed since getting out after that 2010 sentencing. Edson has racked up at least seven more criminal convictions, and he's facing more charges, but police have to find him first. Burlington Police Chief John Murad says they are following leads and are actively looking for him. In the studio, Cam Smith, Channel 3 News.